Anyone who eats food in the urban setting can benefit from City Blooms. We are working to reconnect people with the food they eat and the farmers who grow. My name is Nick Halmos, and I'm the CEO and founder of City Blooms Urban Agriculture. City Blooms is a company that develops and implements technology and solutions for urban farming, primarily the production of hyper-local and ultra-fresh produce for urban environments. The whole operation of City Blooms is unique. The water being sprayed, how it gets filtered through, how you put the nutrients in by computer, you've never seen done. There's no dirt. They're like, well, where is it growing out of? And then you lift up this little mat, it's growing out of here. We have to increase global food production across the board, which means starting to explore new ways of producing food in the urban environment. We can produce food as it's being consumed. As a result, there's very little waste in the production and distribution cycles. Similarly, when it comes to food miles, we can measure farm to fork in yards rather than miles. The City Blooms approach is a marriage between time-tested agricultural techniques and modern Internet of Things technology. We've had to develop systems that are scalable, modular, and spatially flexible. When I want to know what's going on, I can log on to the City Blooms dashboard and I can see real-time data of what's going on at the different clusters around the city. I can also change set points. I can change the climate set points and the nutrient set points. And I can see the history of both those set points and the data. Was it hotter yesterday, etc. We have made a turnkey system that includes all the components that someone needs to get set up in a parking lot or on a roof and grow food. You have the farmer in your backyard, how much better would that be? Well, it's better than organic. When I look towards the ultimate vision of City Blooms, I see a, an urban environment in which people have increased the quality of food they're eating because it's grown where they live.